The Palestinian resistance movement Hamas has launched fresh rocket attacks against the occupied territories amid the Israeli regime's military offensive in the southern city of Rafah in the besieged Gaza Strip. Hamas fired at least eight rockets at Tel Aviv and its surroundings on Sunday, while rocket sirens were sounded in other cities and towns. The Israeli military said the rockets were launched from Rafah, claiming that several of them were intercepted. No injuries have been reported. The latest development came hours after Abu Ubaidah, spokesman for Al Qassam Brigades, Hamas's military wing, said the resistance group has carried out a complex operation against the occupation forces in Gaza's Jabalia refugee camp. In a recorded message released early on Sunday, Al Qassam's spokesperson Abu Obeda said the operation saw resistance fighters luring a Zionist force into an ambush inside a tunnel and killing, wounding and capturing all its members. Recently, Hamas released a video showing a bloodied Israeli soldier being dragged along the ground in a tunnel. Additionally, photos of seized military fatigue and a rifle were made public. In response, the Israeli military issued a statement denying the claims made by Hamas's armed wing, asserting, there is no incident in which a soldier was abducted. The conflict escalated when Israel launched its brutal war on Gaza on October 7th last year. This was after Palestinian resistance groups carried out a historic operation against the usurping regime in retaliation for its intensified atrocities against the Palestinian people. Since the start of the aggression, the Israeli regime has been accused of committing war crimes in Gaza. Reports indicate that at least 35,000 984 Palestinians, mostly women and children, have been killed, and about 80,643 others injured.